our students will typically spend about a year here and then move to CERN for a year or so. That's really important. You, you build the, the scientific network a lot more effectively when it's in person. And it's very important because they need to understand what does it mean to work in a very big collaboration. Of course, we have a big group here, it's like 40 people. But then in Atlas, we are like 3,000. And so they need to understand what does it mean. And being at CERN gives you the idea of what does it mean to work in a, such a big collaboration. There's nothing else like it. Like you, you, it's a completely irreplaceable thing having this I mean, there are other particle physics labs around the world, but none of them have this completely huge international collaboration. This is the place to be for experimental particle physics, really, and for any kind of physical science experiment. This is you know, the largest that's ever been conducted. To meet all the people you work with, not just via email, but actually finally face to face, and to have the opportunities to, ex to just interact with all these different bits of technology and physics is just unique. There's nothing that can replace going to someone's door and asking them. You can read a paper, but if you actually meet the person, then you can discuss, and this is always more fruitful, and I find it invaluable. A lot of the colleagues I have on the experiment are from Japan, from the United States, um, from Germany, and connections you make globally. Um, from the work that I do on my analysis, I will be invited to go on to conferences internationally, and when I go on to you know, do anything, even if outside of research, I'll have those connections in multiple different countries that will help. I feel so grateful to, to have this opportunity because it's su a super rare opportunity basically and uh, the people here really are wonderful and hardworking and you feed off that and there's an energy here. I was still in school when the, um, when the Higgs discovery was made and, and, and all that was going on, it was very exciting and you know watching sort of television documentaries with uh, certain prominent particle physicists and, and, and all these things were going on and, and so now to be able to be here and be at CERN um, and be a part of that is, is, is sort of really quite special and it's, it's um, an opportunity which not many people uh, really get.